off-road white dry portions how's it going tube today I'm gonna to be talking about off-road white dry portions from V2 now, I don't normally show off the can but this one is really cool really cool we're about ready to get a visitor what are you doing? doing a video you wanna be in it? no no? Okay, go put a play doh. That's what the portion looks like. We'll fluff it up a little bit and we'll throw one in. Let's get out the old notes. <clears throat> Off road is a V2's budget snooze. Uh, 9.75 gram can, so a little lighter than uh, your your typical can. 15 portions per can, which come out to 0.65 grams per portion. Now I honestly didn't think that they were that light it, it feels like a just a normal regular portion to me I guess in reality it's somewhere between like a mini and a and a regular size portion 0.8 percent nicotine or eight milligrams per gram regular strength so that comes out to 0.52 percent nicotine or 5.2 milligrams per gram per portion uh, flavor wise, it's just straight. Does that say flower? No, straightforward. I can't read. Straightforward spearmint. That's pretty much all it is. Just a nice mint flavor. I don't get anything else. Um, don't really get any salt. Uh, you're making my camera shake, little girl. Ugh. Let's see. Uh, there is a slight burn at first. It usually goes away pretty quickly though. Uh, and it's a nice cooling sensation. It's uh, very chilly in the upper lip, right? Daddy, what? 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 Uh, actually, for being a white dry portion, uh, it's actually very comfortable in the lip. The, the portion material is actually really soft. Uh, so that's pretty nice. And then, uh... I, I'd have to say this probably is my favorite mint snooze today. I haven't had very many. Um, the Catch Dry Mini, uh, the Mint, Mintha from Scroof, and General Mint. But so far, actually, this is probably my favorite. Um, it's no nonsense. It. I, I thought that I was actually going to get bored with it pretty quickly, but I found that um, when I'm getting ready to go to bed, I usually pop a snooze in. And I actually found it's a nice nighttime snooze. Just kind of gives you minty, fresh breath, and um, I don't wake up in the morning with any weird flavor. <clears throat> of course, I take it out before I go to sleep, though. I haven't fallen asleep with one in yet. <clears throat> but the downside is, it's a it's a little toothpastey flavored. Like um, the first first time I popped it in, I did it in the Yabo. And that was kind of my initial impression was it's kind of toothpastey. But after doing it for a while, um, like I said, I found that using it at night is really nice. If I popped one in after brushing my teeth, I couldn't taste it at all. Just it has like the same flavor as my toothpaste. <laughs> so I guess um, if you like, Daddy, what? That's open. That is open. Yeah. So I guess if you like toothpastey mint. I must say it's a bad thing. It just, uh, it's really cool and refreshing. And this one would be a good one for you. Those clothes are dry. She's very observant. Now I got the dog in here. Boy, you coming in next? <laughs> Boy, this, this is a fun one, isn't it? Uh, so, I actually really enjoyed this one. I don't know... I don't think it's something that I would uh, right. would become an everyday snooze for me. I could see having a couple cans on hand if I want something a little minty. So for that, I'm giving it four out of five Jeeps. It's very good. I like it. I enjoy it. I can't tell that it's a budget Maybe snooze. So. Well, all right. Thank you. Uh -huh. That's it for this one, peeps. Cheers.